started out a little bit rainy but it's clearing up and I can see a clear spot and sunlight towards uh, where I'm heading today so yeah a 28 kilometer day today and it's a countdown it's like three more days three more stretches to go God, I know this is like the unhealthiest thing there is, but it is so good. behind me but look there's a red light it's still on and this is the last train station 65 kilometers from the end of the train
you lose your friends? See the water and the big hill in the distance? We are, well, uh, this is because I'm at the site of a former quarry and uh, yeah, there was a mine here and the, the springs from the earth filled it up so they couldn't mine here anymore so now there's sort of a lake here. The water is very clear and very cold in this lake, that's why you can't go swimming here even if, if it was summer. The trail here is interesting, but at the moment it is super slippery and super steep and super muddy, so it's like technical. Oh, where are my trekking poles? Why didn't I bring them? Now that is an abundance in trail marking. It's like the old window screensaver, right? You had these little windows logos flying at you. That's how it feels like now. Alright, last stop for today before heading on to the bus. Whew. So this was today's hike. Uh, the section of the quarry took me I think an hour or more than I would have expected to walk today which is why I again got into a little bit of a hurry to end here. I still have like 1.5 until the bus stop and the bus and the bus leaves in 33 minutes so I, I just wanted to come here to do a little brief uh, coffee stop and to change all my clothes because uh, thanks to the rain and wearing the rain clothes I had gotten a little bit sweaty but this place is beautiful I definitely want to come back here and film some more and uh, thanks for watching and two more days to go so hang on